guys, it's Nancy Jones and today's video is going to be a, whoa my forehead looks massive. Um, I apologise for that, just generally it is. So today I'm going to be filming a haul video. So whilst I'm doing my vlogs in York, I decided to do a bit of shopping and I have got one, two, three, four, five bags of things here. And when you go through them, some are most are Harry Potter th themed. You have the odd few that aren't. Here, yeah, I'm gonna start off with the shop that must not be named, and just sometimes have to queue outside. For my main shop, I was very lucky and didn't have to queue um, at all. So that was lovely. I just walked straight in because I got there exactly the time it opened. But I actually have to grab something because I've had something in the fridge. But I got, so this is cold, it's been in the fridge for a day. I've got butterscotch beer, which I'm saying butterscotch beer, it's basically butter beer, but apparently it is a bit different. Um, and there's a really cute bottle that'll go on my shelf. Um, I got something wrong there, I was about to say something. And that was 2 99 Yeah, and just to let you know, my total was 74 95 in this one bag, so. So the next thing I have is this little, I'm sort of getting into now, and um, you might be able to tell, but I am sort of getting into these. It's a little Free the House Elves pin badge. It's so cute. And it's just Free the House Elves, and it has a little dobby at the end of the, like in the middle of V and E. So basically, the next thing I got is this, and they're not staying because I loosened them, which wasn't a good idea. So these are these festival bracelets, which I used to have some, I was going to get the ones I've already had, but I lost them, so um, I was going to get the Order of the Phoenix one in Gryffindor, but I got the Society of Promotion of Elfish Welfare, and then I got the Weasley and Weasley little response, and I think this one's my favourite, but like I also love that one. But yeah, I love these and I haven't worn them because I want to do the video. Next thing I actually have is something I love, my favourite creature ever. And I don't know if you can tell by seeing this. I think you can tell. It's a bendable and poseable little bortruckle and I love it so much. And if you have any recommendations of what I should name, oh, what I should name my bortruckle, tell me. Um, and the next thing I got is a top and it's a top i'm actually going to wear so it's going to wear when i go to studios in two months in the tri was a tournament i've decided that i got this to wear in october and it is it's like a replica and also like a cash sort of thing yeah so it's the red and black top from the last from the last the third why am i calling it a trial Oh, I don't know. You know what I mean when Cedric dies that. Oh my gosh, I can't think. Um, and just Potter and yeah, and it's really, really cute and I can't wait to wear it. And this was £25. Anyway, the last thing I got in this shop which totals the £75, £74.95. I'm telling you now, it's very, very, very easy to spend a lot of money in when you buy collectibles. This is my second ever wand. This time it's in the Ollivander's box and not the Wizarding Wand box that I got um, in 2011. So I got one pretty much opened. Um, this is Noble Collection. It's Noble Collection and this is my Hermione Granger wand. Yeah. Even had Arthur and Molly's. Which, Molly's is quite plain, I'm not gonna lie. Arthur's is quite cool. Pardon. I lost the top. How can I lose the top of a one box? Oh. It's fine with it and it's lasting. I got a Hermione Granger artifact box. And I got. Well, inside, I hope you've seen it. I'm going to do a quick overview because I'm not going to unravel this poster, but it's a Yule Ball poster. A Yule Ball hog. Oh my gosh, I pulled it. It's the Yule Ball ornament for like a Christmas ornament and it's really nice and it just says Yule Ball Hogwarts. It's so cute. Um, yeah, that looks... 
I've got a Gildor Lockhart signed photo, which is not a movie, but like, I'm pretty sure it's not. But you can, it's in the book, and it just says, To you, Mindy Granger, with love, Gildor Lockhart. And then I have a love potion, which I can't, it's going to take me forever to get out. Um, and it's Quality Potions Wonder Witch. And then I have two London to Hogwarts Platform 9 3 quarter tickets. I have some OWL exam papers. And then at uh, the end of the OWL, I think I cracked the way it works is like a quite awkward timetable. It has all the days, but I think I've cracked it. And I think I understand that. So. Was meant to be. This was meant to be thirty nine pounds, which isn't the price you get the actual shop. I believe I got it for thirty. Just like yesterday, I just went to on the street. I went to the Yorkshire Soap, the Yorkshire Soap Company, and um, yeah, the Yorkshire Soap Company. And I just got a little birthday card for someone. I put this bag and this morning I went to a little bookshop. I think it was called the Little Apple Bookshop. I, I got a sticker kit. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I was actually going to edit that to make it say Gryffindor when I put it in my head. But it already. Yeah. So this was $7.99 and obviously, yeah. Then we went to the York Dungeon. So I'm just going to show you the photo I think I got. And it's very different from last time. Traitors gonna treat. This is our picture. And we have to be Vikings, and there's some from the castle. Mm. Oh, I forgot to show you. My nana was wearing a green top, so that's the reason she might blend in. Also, the same on this, but you can't really tell as much. Us and what we were like, what we were sentenced for. My dad was a dirty peasant, I was a sheep stealer, my nose was a bad witch, and my granddad was a filthy traitor. So yeah, I went back to the shop that must not be named a bit ago, and I got four things. I got a Quibbler card holder for five pounds. My tall Harry Potter vinyl figure, and I was really hoping to get in Rainbow Sleeping, and I got one of those common ones. I got Harry. It's cute and all, but so wouldn't And the final two things I got was 60p. And I got two button badges, which I don't really get, but it was little Toppy clicking his fingers and chamber secrets. And a Ministry of Magic. I got a little pin um, that says Voice for Women and it has the green the colours. The green, is it green purple? I can't remember, the suffragette colours and this is Vote for Women. Um, but I got that and that is my haul. And I spent over, basically, I basically spent over a hundred pounds, I believe. Um, and I came with a hundred and ten, but I spent more than that because I got, it's so I spent a hundred and twenty something because my dad got me the enamel and my mum gave me a bit of extra money. So, this is all the stuff I got. It was a lot. I'm sorry my video is so long today, but this is the stuff I got in York, and I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next Sunday, whenever I feel like it. Peace out.